Hi, I'm Troy Taylor, Technical Engagement Engineer at Grape City Developer Solutions. The 2018 V1 release of Widgmo includes a new licensing model. This will require a couple of additional steps when setting up a production web application. In this video, we'll create a distribution key and simulate a deployed application using the new 2018 V1 library. Here's a very simple application that uses the flex grid control, which is bound to some randomly generated data via the get data function. If we view this app in the browser as is, we will see a nag screen indicating that the license has not been set. Before we can set the license key, we need to generate a distribution key. To generate a distribution key, you need to log in to grapecity.com and ensure that the license key is registered to your account in the My Licenses section. Already registered, select the Create Distribution Key link in the menu on the right hand side of your account page. To create a distribution key, add the domain names that the application will be deployed to. You want to add all of the domains here. Once the domains are added and the distribution key is generated, the domains cannot be removed. Also, distribution keys cannot be regenerated. If you forget to add a domain name and the key has already been generated, you will have to create a separate distribution key for the forgotten domains. Once the domain names have been added, you can click the submit button to generate the key. Copy the distribution key and place it somewhere safe. This key will only be available for the lifetime of this page. You will not be able to access it any other time. To license a Widgmo application with the distribution key, we will use the Widgmo.setLicenseKey function. The setLicenseKey function must be called before any Widgmo controls are instantiated. Let's place this at the top of our script. Paste the distribution key as a string inside the function call. Now, if we access the application in the browser, the NAG screen does not appear and the watermark does not show either. The distribution key verifies the domain and the application works as expected. Thank you for watching and be sure to check out the latest version of Widgmo on NPM. I'll see you again in July when we release Widgmo 2018 V2.